Hi, I'm making this video about some problems I've had with the Zhao Mi Box 3, which is this box here. The model number is uh, MDZ-16-AB. As you can see on the screen, it's updated to Oreo 8, which is when the problem started. And from looking on Google, uh, various forums, Reddit, there are lots of people who are having exactly the same problem as me in that it will not register with an external hard drive. Uh, FAT32 for me, EXFAT or NTFS just would not do it. The main reason I bought this box was to play 4K videos via external hard drive. So uh, I was just about to send this back. I did a factory reset and I thought, well, I'll, I'll just try um, and just confirm because I didn't want to send it back and for them to say, uh, no, actually it works. And I found that actually it worked. So I started to go back in my steps as to uh, what I'd actually done and what I'd installed and changed on the box. Uh, and basically what I found is that ES File Explorer causes problems. So if I can just show you here, we've got um, Oreo 8, uh, if I go to storage and reset, so we can see it's got my external hard drive there, one terabyte. Now we go up to the little notifications here, Western Digital USB drive, it's a uh, portable USB drive. And when I go to VLC player, you can see that on the browsing of internal memory, my external drive, local network, and open MRL, which I think is for uh, VLC streaming. So, you can see that I have the files here on my disk. So if I play some of these, you can see that these 4K files now work. So this is planet Earth. I'm just going to skip through this. This isn't the uh, the file skipping. This is me skipping through it. I click on the uh, information tab on my TV, and you can see that it is actually in 4K, 60 hertz. So it works. Play another file just to oops show that it's not a a fluke. I'll go back. Okay, so there's another planet Earth, a blue planet rather. Let's see that again, that plays just fine. Absolutely perfect. So, if we now install ES File Explorer, uh, so if I go to get more apps in the Play Store, uh, go to home, go down, top three, and there we go, number three there. So ES File Explorer. Quickly install that. I think this is quite a common app. Uh, I'm reasonably new to Android boxes, but uh, most people I know who've got one have this app installed. Uh, it's quite a useful app to use. Okay, so if I open it up, it's on sideways for some reason. No, I don't want that. Um, there we go. Okay, so you can see that it's actually showing my USB drive here, USB 1003. But if I click on it, it asked me to allow access to the drive, okay. And it says, sorry, current OTG USB device format is not supported. Okay, this external drive is EXFAT. It's a one terabyte EXFAT. But I was finding the same problem with FAT32 and NTFS. Uh, I was trying all sorts of different things, thinking that my hard drives were broken. Uh, but I've now found 
So if we go back to VLC, the just the act of allowing File Explorer to have access to your hard drive now means, in fact, if we go up to the system settings here, you go to storage and reset. There we go, it's not showing there anymore. So if we go back, go to VLC, try and play those files again. We can see the videos have gone and we go down and browse internal memory, local network and open MRL. There is nothing there for uh, an external drive. Um, all right, so um, now the solution, if you like, of this um, is to get ES File Explorer and uninstall it. OK, and you can if you really need to use ES uh, File Explorer for something, you can install it and then uninstall it and, and that will fix it. OK, if you temporarily need to have ES File Explorer on your device for whatever reason, then um, that works. OK, so VLC player. Ah, OK, I need to uh, restart my box, so long click. We start. Okay, so this will take a, a minute or two. Um, I'm by no means an expert. Uh, this is the second Android box I've ever owned. I'm, I'm not a, a developer. I don't know how to debug boxes or root them or downgrade them or anything like that. But it just seems to be reading through all the comments um, that uh, I hadn't seen this come up before and maybe this will be useful. Maybe not, I don't know, but I thought I'd put it out there anyway. Um, so once this has booted up, there we go, you can see that the, uh, the Western Digital Drive is up there. It's been detected by going to settings storage and there it is disk f for some reason it only takes the first letter of the uh, the disk drive now if i go back to um vlc new external storage detected so we click yes And my videos start coming up. Uh, and I've tried this on a couple of different hard drives, uh, all in EXFAT. Um, and, and it's the same with, with all of them. Um, so if I just go on to this one, the Blue Planet here. There we go. We can see it. I'll just skip through that. Let's get to some... They stick together. There we go. And... For me, this was the main reason of me buying um, this box to play 4K video on an external hard drive, and it works, okay? Uh, I'm gonna try and install a few other apps and then just see what happens with that. Um, and hopefully this will, will help in some way. Um, now I did try Kodi before and it still wasn't registering with Kodi. I know a lot of people like to use Kodi. Um, so it's not a fix for that. But um, for me, this works. Uh, and hopefully somebody with a, a lot more knowledge than, than I have might be able to, uh, to use this to, to develop some kind of uh, proper fix. Okay, um, thanks very much. Um, do obviously to ask any questions in the comments if you have any. Uh, and please uh, like and subscribe. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.